reason why I wanted to come to you today, and we have formed an organization that basically deals with the church under fire, and our response to it is one that deals with policy. Now let me just tell you what policy is. Policy is the law. And we understand that the law plays a major part in our world in which we live. It's a system. And the church has a responsibility not only to deal with the crises in our community, but we also have a responsibility that deals with our what we call our fiscal and our political responsibility. And so today I wanted to talk about um, the ex-offender, the incarceration crises that we face. So we have a group what we call the Bay Area Action Council and what we actually are responding to is the crises of reentry. Um, we took that as our standpoint because we understand that those who are coming out of incarceration affect the whole of our community. It doesn't matter whether you're rich, or whether you poor. Everybody now has somebody or knows somebody or is related to somebody who has been affected by our incarceration system. The question is when they return back to our community are we ready to deal with them as they are? The Barry Action Council was started in Los Angeles. A young man by the name of Eugene Williams was in a small group that dealt with church people. And let me just give you the story in brief. There was a young lady who was doing well in her church. She was saved, sanctified, full of the Holy Spirit. Uh, she was single and she was doing great work in the church. Miss Johnson Mother Johnson, one of the pillars of the church, grandson had been in prison for 14 to 20 years and he had just came home. Quite naturally, Miss Johnson told the pastor, my grandson's coming home and we need to receive him. The church received her grandson. Her grandson ended up getting into a relationship with this young lady at the church. They had unprotected sex. She couldn't go to her pastor because she was going to be demonized for having sex outside of marriage. She couldn't go to the church because she had been a pillar in the church for all of those years of her young adult life. She went back to the young man. The young man brushed her off and she ended up leaving the church with HIV and AIDS. Then she left him to have other relationships in the church and it became an epidemic in the church because of his incarceration in prison and we are under attack because for the most part the church is not prepared to deal with the crises and the issues that we face on a daily basis. In your presentation you can see that the Barry Action Council's mission we are a holistic ministry that deals, that will enrich the lives of people in Alameda County, individuals and families. We want to deal with them through education, which is another workshop. We want to deal with youth and young adult services, which is again another workshop. We want to deal with health and wellness, which we will actually will be talking about uh, partly today. We want to deal with uh, workforce and development or economic de development, which that is a whole nother workshop within itself. But we also want to deal with civic engagement, our responsibility to policy.